we say to people who ain't that nice to us? Hello you. I painted that. So I've got a new thing that I wanted to get out of. I'm going to call it ranch here, but I don't know how long it's going to last. The original idea was to just run off some shit. decided to take this as a test run. Because there's been something that's been on my mind lately. I don't want to share. I wanted to talk about tests today. Now, I've finished sixth form and I've done school. And I'm still doing tests. It's not a bad thing. I'm not hating on them. I'm just saying. The point I want to make is, why do people get so worked up about them? Let's take your GCSEs, for example. Now, we've all done this. We've all been in school. And then there's that massive long line, and there's people generally crying, sobbing, and thinking, no, this is going to make or break their life. It's not. It's just a piece of paper. And every kid wanted to say this to the teachers, apart from one select group. We call these the book cuts, right? And they are basically just, they spend their whole life grafting at a book. And even they are nervous like you've got to take it someone that knows that they should actually ace this test because they've actually done revision yet the other 200 people in the line haven't done it probably looked at a maths equation last night even these kids are nervous about it and they don't look nervous because they've never really spoken in their school life um you only know them because of their name in the register they're usually really really quiet but um the one thing you will see is their legs shaking and that's about it the next people you've got is the jokers in the line who like, they just don't care. Like, good or bad, it's not going to affect them. They're probably in there for an entertaining time too. I've been in tests in the past. Do you mind? Yeah, there's just the jokers that are in the line. And then we should come to me. So I would just kind of be trying to talk to... The distractions are ridiculous. Yeah, I'd kind of be just chatting to everyone and just seeing how they feel about it. I was trying to sell them some pens because everyone knows on exam day, if you sit, no one wants to put their hand up when it comes to, have you got a pen? And you ain't got one. No one really wants to be that guy. So yeah, I'd send them about 10p a go. But anyway, that that's not my point. The point is, you get from it what you put in. That's, that's why, with, with testing that, I've never ever once in my life been nervous about one. I've just gone there and I've done it, I've put 100% in. If the test goes bad, then it goes bad. Because what I know, I know from what I've revised. So if I haven't done enough, then that's gonna correlate on paper. All you can really do is your best and you can only put down what you know. All of this come from uh, something that I saw this week. It was an Instagram post, caption ones with writing on it, that said, life's jokes, give me 16 years of school and then not give me a job after. Because for a lot of people, that's what it's like. Anyway, this was the first rant one. It's not really a rant. I wanted to ease it in. Um, I didn't want to do one about fucking garbage bins. But um, yeah, that's it. I've been king. Please like, comment and subscribe. Your boy King Out Done. And make sure you recognize 